another day, another blessing, another win. Yo, yo, that's crazy, bro. Yo, bro, chill. I'm so sorry to that guy, but I remember this day was uh, was during the protests that were going on in Nairobi. As you can see, on the other side of the highway, we have the parliament buildings near Bunge Towers. This is not Mombasa Road. This is the other highway past Uru Highway, past the first roundabout, the one that connects Uru Highway and Haile Selassie Avenue. And then going on the left, you will go towards Upper Hill. Then when you proceed, you are heading towards the parliament way and then you will divert. I can see this guy had some fast warnings. There was a point where the first motorcycle guys approached him and then they tried to snatch it. Luckily, he withdrew his hand behind. So they missed, they kind of missed. But now, other guys, they just came, you know, during protests, we don't know who are the protesters. Some people might be there for the sole purpose of protesting, but other people are there for other reasons. Other people are there for evil reasons, as we have seen from the video. And I heard the guy screaming that, help, help, no one was helping. That's normal, bro. You see, in Nairobi, people might see you being robbed in the broad daylight, bro, and they might not help you. Even if the onlookers have outnumbered the robbers, they are kind of skeptical on what the robbers have they might be having weapons so everybody is scared for their lives you can't depend on the people around you i've seen from other scenarios but luckily i think this guy retained his i saw him going for something it was like a bicycle or what so that's a nice footage i don't know if, if he goes to report the scenario to the police if they might be able to recognize these guys that's uncalled for but anyway i will advise you man you see during this public events this rowdy events like protests in an area like nairobi bro that's when goons find their way towards these areas you feel me normally these areas you can never find goons lacking there because they are protected areas they find their way there when they know that there are there is a large mass so they can camouflage inside because this is a highway bro there is no way you can rob people on the highway when there is no nothing going on bro like it doesn't make sense. They rob people at places where, let's say, ghetto places, areas where there is no traffic going on, you feel me? Hidden places. As much as we are blaming the robbers, I'm not trying to defend the robbers, but hey, it's so risky. On the highway, bro, near, and you are seeing motorcycles passing by. How many scenarios have we seen robbers or false snatchers riding on motorbike? And when they spot you, they just snatch it. So, man, let's be careful out there. Man. Guys, let me know what you think about this scenario in the comment section. Hopefully, the guy finds justice. I'm about to go big. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean?